We are still tracking Metro for you tonight. And for the first time, we are hearing from Metro's general manager about this video just circulating all over online. It's kind of hard not to look at it when people are squeezing their yeah. way through and jumping over these brand new doors that were just installed, meant to keep people from, you know, not doing that, not paying to ride Metro. Yeah, yoga mat and everything. Our Delia Gonzalez <laughs> picks it up from here. Metro has long told us fair evasion costs the system $40 million today. The GM says they haven't quite figured out how many of those folks are actually students and eligible to ride free in D.C. Metro knows an unknown percentage of those riders who are skipping the fare are D.C. school students who can already ride for free but aren't using their card. We do need those taps. So I would call that tap evasion versus fare evasion per se. But we're working really close uh, with, with the district to try to get that managed a little bit better. For the others who we caught on camera squeezing through the new fare evasion doors, some changes. We're told the next shipment of doors closes that gap. Metro is spending nearly $40 million of its capital budget to install the taller, stronger fare gates first at 10 high traffic metro stations by the fall. General Manager Randy Clark admits they're never going to get to zero fare evasion. And so no matter how many people put out sensational videos on the media or social media, that's like people could do that all day long. It's not going to change our focus. We set up a low income fare program for people. Uh, we want people that really need that to sign up. Uh, but I think it's clear from videos there's a lots of people that can afford to pay that are just not following the rules. Metro will continue to make adjustments to the first round of fare gates by the fall. After that, they will spend the next year retrofitting all of the fare gates throughout the system. Outside of Metro headquarters, Delia Gonsalves, WUSA 9.